like if I was to say, why do you get an iArcade? arcade? Bang. Boom. Toplin Library. Look at it. Look at how many Toplin games. So all many. arcade games, all ready to go. Just look at the shooter category for Toplin. That's the reason to get an iArcade. arcade. And PP and BBs, but that's oh, not a shooter. Uh, absolutely. Uh, hey Brad, you yeah. know what that you know what this list tells me? That the people behind the iArcade arcade know video games and arcade games they know how to curate a shooter library on this this system. is this is the shooter library machine i mean just look at this list and then boom all these too Jesus. Strikers 1945 <laughs> ten guy a, a handmade uh, lovingly made recreated space invaders that's original that's not on any other type of machine you know Brad, imagine skies in the hunt Cy battler just Android imagine, Stuner, Space ju Bomber. Just, just these titles alone, Brad, on a machine and people would freak out. Now you have the ability to add 280 more. Can you imagine if <laughs> Arcade went up made – could you imagine if Arcade went up made an IREM cab with R-Type 1 and 2 oh. in the hunt, Image Fight, image fight yeah, Dragon yeah. Breed, yeah. Battle yeah. Chopper, and Armored Police <laughs> oh Unit Gout? Oh, well, all those games are on <laughs> Arcade. <laughs> then all of a sudden, AAA <laughs> – yeah, it's, <laughs> if you're into the shmup category, I mean, come on, wow. I mean, just these two pages here. This is why you get an IRK to play shmups. I mean, just look at them. I mean, they got them all. They got tons of, of great shmups. And you know what's um, so crazy, Brad? There's so many more. Yeah. Like so many yeah. more great shoot 'em ups out there. I know. They're just going to keep getting them. There's one that I love so much because it's so wacky. Um, Prehistoric Island 2. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah. Prehistoric Island 1 is, is good, but Prehistoric... Prehistoric Island 2 is one of like the top 10 games that I'd love to come to arcade. And I think it could be possible uh, from some of the other games that they got because it's a, it's a Neo Geo game. Okay. Now, now we're ready. We're ready to throw down. We're ready to throw down now because it's time. It's time to get this over with. All right. Take Space Invaders off the list. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys. Top 10 shooters. Now, now, I just came up with this list, but we're going to edit this. This is not permanent, but. This was what I came up. Truxton series, Batsugan, Strikers, Tengai, Rangox guys, R-Type. Space Invaders, Infinity Gene, In the Hunt, and Stormblade. But we're going to edit this list because I want it to be a collaborative list. Wow. What do you guys – how do I need to change this list to make it more representative of what you guys think? Well, I, I guess tell the, you what needs to stay. Yeah, that's – For me, Tango needs to stay let's, on there. Let's yeah. pull it back up. Let's pull it up. Let's pull it up and just decide on what, what's a must stay. Truxton, must stay. What do you think? Truxton 2. You have that Truxton two. The next two games are definitely yeah. top tens. Yeah. Truxton they series gotta, one and two. I gotta pick those up as well. I mean, Popular. you saw what happened when Truxton came out on IRG. Like, everyone yeah. got into it. Everyone like, got it into just it. became like, like for a couple of sudden, weeks. All of a sudden, all, all of a sudden, all of a sudden, it was no longer any good. No like, longer how any can, good. Yeah, I mean, this this game is one of the greatest shmups ever made. Truxton so, is so hard, but it's so rewarding. I mean, this game is fantastic. The and, music. And for a time, Brad, we were all playing as a as a big community. Mm -hmm. Truxton brought us together. We were leaderboard chasing like crazy. And then something happened. And nobody wanted the leaderboard chase something with us happens. anymore. <laughs> I know. What happened? I don't get it. This yeah, game is still true. great. If you don't know about Truxton and Truxton 2, these are must pickups. This Absolutely. is at the top of the list. I would say... If you get anything from Toplin, make sure you get these. These are great ones. That's Sugan too, but this is this is at the top. This is the top of the class. Yeah, Trucks and Series. Batsugan? Yes. Yeah, maybe just Trucks and Series, in. really. Batsugan? Yes. I mean, if uh, Tiger Heli, Tiger Heli is kind of like the uh, musket ball, the originator of Shmups. It was the first one to have where you could uh, use bombs to clear the screen. This one is the AK-47 of the Tokyo line. The final game, Bad Sugan. That's got to be top 10 for sure. Yeah. What do you guys think? That's a top 10. Oh, it's a great looking game. It's so smooth. 
Final game of Token, Masterpiece, Buttery Smooth, just fantastic mechanics. Um, that's just one of Token's best. So, I think I'm going to like everything. Should we'll short, we'll short list it. Okay, <laughs> uh, right now, before we move on, are all four of us in agreement that that needs to be in Yes. Yeah. Token, oh, final yes. game. Okay. Strikers. <laughs> yes. Yes. <Go> <laughs> These next two games are just masterpiece schmups. I mean, Strikers series. Strikers. Yeah, yeah. Both, Strikers. both of them are good. Which one do you like more, Brooklyn? Plus or 1945? I th you know what? I thought I liked the original better, but. The original better? Yeah. We played. Uh... When we play this one on the Friday Night Arcade Show, and when, when B saw us playing as he showed up, because it's one of his favorite uh, shoot marks. Yeah, B Kongs or Russ loves this one. And uh, shout out to Kongs or Russ. Uh, he tried the one quarter challenge. Papa Brad did win on this one, and I held on to my uh, score because B Kong did not beat me in the play. This is a fantastic schmuck. You can't go wrong. Someone spin their IRK in the strikers. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I saw that. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's nice. And uh, even though it's down. like, even though it's like classic like World War II airplanes, like if they have robots, it's just crazy yeah. at the top. It's fantastic. If you had to pick just one, you go, you go the remix or you go the original. What do you guys think? I have plus, so I don't have the original. They both play really smooth, I believe. On the on the plus. The is, stages are remixed. Yeah, and I think they added some some stuff on the side so you can see. Yeah, like, like that's why I went with strikers because they they added like this this thing. I think it's on the left. You can see your power up as you go. Yeah, yeah. So that's why I went with strikers, and I think it's it's remixed because after stage one, I think it's the stage. Oh, there you go. Okay, mixed up. Mm -hmm. That's cool. Yeah, strikers nineteen forty five. Okay, I think they both have leaderboards, Chris. Chris in the chat wants to know the difference. I I bought the one I bought Strikers 1945 and it does have leaderboards and online. I'm pretty sure I have both. 40 the 45 uh, plus does not have leaderboards, but it is online. The original is online and leaderboards. Yes, then I would go with the original. Yeah, I would go, go with, with the original. Hundred percent, hundred percent. I'd go with the original. Yeah, then. you get leaderboards. Um, and leaderboards online. are a huge thing on shmups. Um, yep. Yep. But, uh, this game plays smooth games. as butter, butter yeah, though. Like, when butter, you fire, yeah. like, so good, so good. Look at the gameplay yeah, it though. Plays I mean, so well. This is this is this is you know this is why I Arcade is the king of the shmups. I mean, okay. these games are fantastic. You can't. I would I would say pick both of them up, but if I'm gonna pick one, I guess I'll pick the original. Yeah, yeah. Brad. As a fan of shoot 'em ups, it's. Mm -hmm. It's so much fun being able to own these games, like to own it like is. legit it copies. Is. Cause you, you know, we all know we like, like you can play anything anywhere, but knowing that Thank you're you, playing Raven. like a copy that is made sure that it is done. You're playing optimized. the way it was meant to be played. Yeah, optimized. Like, yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. You got to have guy, this one. so well in our yeah, game. Yeah, Next yeah. one. Definitely top 10 again. Dude. Another one. Uh this so game this, is as this good is as a it gets. Buy. Yeah. This is a the, must buy. This is a top wow. ten. For me, I, I couldn't recommend a game higher. Wow. I introduced this one this to uh, the I Arcade Zone. This was the game mm. when I went on the show mm. that I chose to, to play against them. Mm. It's it's got all that like Japanese mythology in it. 
the levels are just wild. Uh, every the show, character Chris. that you you play with, you'll start on a different type of level. It's nuts, man. Yep. So, this game, board, uh, this game, you gotta get. It's just so good. Yeah. I mean, that's. All, I yeah, mean, this would be so this would be one of the ones that I would personally say. I just that like it. Good. I just love that whole style. It's funny. You can see I've purchased most of them. Rangox, guys, you're going to kill me when we get to space. I'm going to cry. I'm literally going to, the tear is going to appear yeah, in like Papa Rangox, guys, is not a Come on, a Jeff, you need to fight game, for it. so cool. Getting into some of my favorites, Rangox, yeah. guys. No, this Rangox, is not guys, an old game. This is a new no. game. It's it's basically the closest you're going to get to a cave shooter on the Iron Cave. Was this yeah, a cell phone game? I don't know. I don't think so, but it's fantastic. It's like a fireworks. Here's some gameplay footage. It's just like, look at this. I mean, look at this. This is crazy. This is literally like, this is how it starts one second into the game. Yeah, it's like the first level, probably. Yeah, it's complete bullet hell. Look at that. It's a cup of a warning. Look at it. Beautiful. Yeah. It's so colorful. It's everything, so cool. and it's fantastic. I mean, and it's yeah, a modern. It's, it's a modern. And even, shooter. Yeah, it's a modern even shooter. though it's new, even though it's new, the like the, the people that made that, you can tell, you can tell the, the shooting up ones so that they.
Yeah. R type. Uh, next one. I mean, there's no doubt this is in the the top games. R type. Brad, these just a heads up. These R type and R type two. These next six games have a chance of being in the top ten. These next. Six. Yeah. This is this is this, <laughs> this is, is the insane. good stuff. Yeah. We're getting to the good stuff. Wow. R type one two like no doubt right. Yeah. Love the game. I love the way it has like the alien type artwork too, like from the aliens. Kind of like, oh. it, it's it's just it's my painful, only, man. My it only is caveat so is brutal. Though. It's a, it's like the real arcade game, so yeah. don't think don't think you're gonna come in here like the Nintendo. And it's, you know, gonna, the only, it's gonna kick your butt. The only way that I actually see like the third stage is for Glenn the Glenn Retro Show. He's a boss at this, and he played it live, and I was like, oh, there's the third stage. I cannot just you have to just stick Nick. This is the game you could probably. That's what I want to see next. You need to get the, you need to get our type. Yeah. 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 Do some videos. Yeah. Do some videos of our type. Our type too. How, to, how to get the past the first yeah. game. <laughs> they loved um, playing. For me, the next game is very special. Space Invaders. I Arcade took the time to make a fantastic version of Space Invaders. Never heard um, of this I, only, I can only say one person. We can only have one person here is really qualified <laughs> to talk about space. Tell us about Space Invaders I Arcade. Oh, space oh, yeah. Invaders is fantastic. I've actually never played the actual arcade version, so this is my first experience playing it on a home arcade console, and the experience I enjoyed very immensely and uh, worked really hard, and we actually rolled the scoreboard over, over 100K which is very difficult to do. Insane. And, and, and uh, man, the leaderboards on that are going to be insane. I can't wait till they get released. I want to see everybody on there. And, uh, yeah, let's let's get after it, guys. It, this It's one of the all-time classics. Yep. Yeah, absolutely. Shoot them up of all shoot them up. And, uh, and I'm so freaking yeah. old, I can actually say I was there in the arcade. I was there, too. Like, when they <laughs> first put that first. freaking game in there, and you couldn't even yep. get close to it. I was like a little kid I, watching I play everyone on, play it. I had to play on a box. Mm -hmm. I was too little when it came out, and this I remember – sitting mm -hmm. and playing it in an arcade on a box and it's a bunch of teens and bell bottoms <laughs> yeah. yeah this was the first arcade i ever played you know, is it wow at a kmart in the customer service area and uh, my mom just gave me a quarter and this game just you know i was just captivated by it but it's actually the first arcade game I ever probably the first video game wow. i have played and, um, I was even amazed is, when I came back and they put the gel over the screen to make it in color they they did not rush this one out the door this took what a year and a half at least yeah. for them to develop yes. and yeah. it's pixel by pixel space invaders but it's just the best version i mean they did such a great job it's fantastic the the uh, backdrop emulation is fantastic the gameplay is fa every trick you can do in the arcade game space invaders works and it's just dead on i mean for just the authenticity that they went through to get it right, I mean, this is a must own. If you have an iArcade and you don't have Space Invaders, you're missing out. This yeah, game now's is, the time is, to get it. Great yeah. price. Great well, price. Well, this, right this is a game you got to have because it's just so good. Well, it's I don't consider 12. it a shoot 'em up, but I consider it a very important game in video game history. If there weren't yes. games like that, they, yeah. like video games may not have continued. Hey, you know, you know. That was the stuff that really. Created shortages it. to me. To, yeah. to me. To me. I always called them the Holy Trinity. You know, you have Space Invaders, Galaxian, Galaga. You Those have Space the Invaders, then, then the Galaxian, the first video game, first video game in color, ever. Then Galaga, just perfect perfection. You know, double ships. Yeah. It's just you know, it's the fact that they have Space Invaders. You can't go wrong. Oh boy. I'll, I'll throw I'll throw it at the somewhere. panel. I mean, what could knock what could knock Infinity Gene off out of out of what's left? Let's go back and look at the list. Go back to your list. Yeah, in the in the hunt, in the hunt. Gene. Um, this one for me is like a masterpiece. It's, yeah, yeah. Get in it the on there. In uh, the hunt. If you, add it to your list, please. Like, yeah. There's, there's not, there's, no one even needs to say anything anymore. Hunt. Put it on your list. Made by the people, made by the, the people that did the Metal Slug the series. Board. I mean, this yep. this game is fire. Online um, leaderboards, and it's fantastic. When I Arcade announced this game, that's when I knew that they knew what they were doing, because this is a fantastic game. Um, if you've ever had the chance to play this, this is this is definitely a must buy. Um, just a fantastic game. 
submarine themed, but like the, the art and graphics are like the metal slug style. It's fantastic. In the hunts, definitely in the top. Yeah, me. submarine theme, but it gets you know like it gets like like stuff that can't happen in reality. <laughs> like it gets crazy. Yeah. You know, it's, it's crazy. Insane. It's way over the top. <laughs> In the hunt, okay, but it's already on the list. Stormblade, this is I was ten. Say, in the hunt, staying right. Yeah. So yeah. what do we take? Yeah. What do go, you want to bring in and take yeah. off? Go to your other list, Brad. The one that you had earlier. Let's see if you can. The pull big it list. Up. Yeah. What do we want? See. We we want Toplin or do we want everything else? Jeez. Oh, so you don't oh. even have the game Paradise on there. Um, Andros Dunos is a classic. Right here, the game Man. Paradise. Yeah, it is at the bottom. Oh, there it is. Yeah. Another good oh, one yeah, is this the one Paradise. Too. This one is great. I mean, another the thing about this up, one is, up, yeah, yeah, it's like yeah, a cute em up. up. And uh, it's you start an arcade with a bunch of candy cabs, and then it, it shows some pinball machines. It's fantastic. Yeah, show this, this one. Is so cool. This is really Let cool. Let me see. Like crazy bosses. Like they transform well, Raven, into Raven taught stuff. me something. Thank you, Raven. The game Paradise. Actually, a, a, a very popular game. game. Yeah, see, look at all the candy cabs. See them? Yeah, it's this all game video so game cool. theme stuff. You go through the arcade, you go into the claw machine, you go through mm -hmm. a pinball. I love this one. Different pickable characters. Yeah, it's good. Yeah, it's definitely. Uh... Cool look at look at the billboard in the background. <laughs> That was a Super Nintendo game. It. Yep. Yeah, this one's different for sure. Watch, you, this gonna. This is the first boss. That yeah, um, it's coming up. Arcade's gonna transform into the boss. It's, it's insane. Look at that. <laughs> it looks like a drum arcade. Look, it's so cool, man. And. Like we said earlier, this breaks up the monotony of all the other type of shooting. Yeah, because I mean, it's it's not arcade. it's not just a plain shooting. It's not it's a totally different feel. And you don't know what's coming next the first time you play. Really, it. this and Space Bomber are two oddball ones that I would say yeah. are great. That, that like you must play. Space really Bomber is of more of a twisted version mm -hmm. of Space Invaders. Space this Invaders, is more yeah. of a shoot like an actual shoot 'em up. Mm -hmm. You know, with moving levels. Game Paradise, very good game. Let's keep. going. No, I literally but you don't have through. it on the top ten, right? No, no, no. But, but yeah, could but it come yeah. In? I mean, I wanted could to discuss it. I wanted to discuss it. I didn't want to like you know. I just think we need to come with like a, a group decision because I because I'm thinking it. about uh, not about like I'm thinking about making a list where the viewers mm. that are watching it can, if they're looking to buy games, can purchase something and have like a really good, uh, a good a bunch of shoot 'em ups, but that are all slightly different. Yeah. Or, okay. Well, well, then the game paradise has to be on that list. Yeah, mm. and Boogie Wings has to be on that list. And too. in the hunt has to be on there. And in the hunt has to be on that. Rangok Skies, I think, should be on there. Yeah, different. that's yeah. because that that is it's very modern. different. Even though it's not yeah. like an yeah. arcade game, it's really yeah. Cool. I mean, based on your parameters, okay. Brooklyn, then it does change the list. Okay, well, let, we... let's kill. Okay, like Stormblade is a great '90s kind of clone of a Toplin game. Let's take that off. What do you think about that? Okay. Take that off, put on what? The Game Paradise? Yeah, yeah. you want to... 
Is that the one you want to pick? Or, you know, because we got a lot of good games that kind of yeah, fit Yeah, I would say out of all, Space like, Bomber. the cute em up style, mm-hmm. uh, Game Paradise is the best one. It is good. I love it. I did a review of that game, too, on my channel, if you want to find out more about it. Any other addition subtractions? Like, this will be our top 10 of the panel. Anything we need to bring in or out? When you say Truxton 2, like, are you saying that it's like, just don't even get Truxton 1, just get Truxton 2 instead? Truxton 2 has online two-player. and yeah. They both have leaderboards. That's... Let's just, I mean, I would really say you should get both. But, I mean, if I, I mean, pick one over another, trust the two com- is easier. Don't you, I think it's only fair that you got to make a choice between uh, yeah, Space Invaders I, and Space Invaders Infinity. I'm thinking the same you way. You can't have yeah, it taken up two you spaces. You can't have two spots, right? And everybody's trying to make a towards, diverse. Okay, list okay. Here. I would, I, I know it's going to be sacrilege. I'm going to get a lot of hate, but I would kill Space Invaders Infinity Gene to have the original arcade. I think. Just because but, but, of what it means to have it on the cab and the time they spent on it. Yeah, but that's so tough. I, I tend to agree with you, Brad. You got to leave the original on there, right? I mean, it's, it's it would not have been so easy to do a half baked port, a half baked yeah. version and just throw it on there. Black and white. It would have been no overlays. Think how easy that would have been for IRK, but they took the time to totally redo the game. So I, mean, it's, I would it's say perfect. infinity gene, as much as I love it, I would say that would be the one that goes, even though it's a more traditional br- to Brooklyn's mm. point of a. And that gives us game. an ad. What do we want to add? Because we just Oof. took a game away. All right, go back. I to want your, people uh, to play Boogie Wings. It's so crazy. Boogie Wings is insane. I play that mm. all the time. And Every you can level your, is different. It's probably one I don't have. I think. And you can pick your stages out of yeah. order. You're not forced to play the stages in any particular order. Don't you even mm. get to play the end of the game, like when it's doing the credits? So yeah, I think you just get to man. keep shooting. It's, it's wild. wild. Raven, what do you think? You're in the chat. Let's see. It's a Data foot. East game, too. They, they always made great games. Mm-hmm. Raven says Boogie Wings should be in the top 10. Yeah. How about Boogie Wings? Boogie Wings is amazing. Wings. Every single level is a What's spectacle different about in it? that so game. Different. You will never. Different about it? Dude, you fight mechanics. Santa Claus in this freaking game. Come on, Santa Claus, like okay. a giant robot Santa. The, the levels where you go through the museum just blew me away. Well, that is an absolute must play. And and what's different is you can actually exit your vehicle, jump in other vehicles. Correct. You and can, you can also bring bombs in tow with you, and you can use them to destroy the uh, play field. Yeah. It's, it's different. Cool. It's a different yeah. Five, You can hijack. You can, like, ride animals in that game. Yeah, it you can like, ride anything animals. That's, any ball, sure. Anything that's there, you can jump on it and take yes. it. It's totally worth it's playing, nuts. and like Brooklyn said, there's a there's a Santa Claus level that's uh-huh. just ridiculous. Is everyone in agreement? This yes. will we'll lock down our Raven top ten. Yeah, about. it's so diverse. So many things going on in there. The thing is, with this list, every game is very different. I mean, if you yeah. had this list of shmups. I mean, You're just imagine if you could have all these great shmups on one cab. Just imagine it. Oh, wait, you can. <laughs> for the low price of an average price of $500. Bucks. 50, well, these 10 for the price of, of, of a cardboard arcade, you can have this. <laughs> That's right. Three ninety nine on sale. Three ninety nine. Boogie Wings is, is our last ad. We locking it down as our top 10? Mm-hmm. That's the panel. Lock down. Lock it down. Lock too bad we didn't have a side battler on there. That was a, that's a good <laughs> one too. Hey, <laughs> you could be yeah, right, throw that in. I know. Yeah. Well, we got to keep it at ten. That's ten, huh? One, two, three, well, we four, five. We have six, to pick ten seven, out of fifty-three. Nine, ten ten out of fifty-three. <laughs> it's that's too hard. Those, those, it's hard. It yeah. There's too many. And they're all the good. The thing is, yeah, this is the strongest category in IRK. Totally. So if you're going to go heavy in something, I mean, uh, you don't go heavy in fighters in IRK. Yeah. You go heavy in shmups because this is what it, this is what this machine excels yeah. at. Yeah, I'm um, I'm glad Boogie made the list in the game Paradise because it showcases the diversity of the shooter lineup totally. Okay, awesome. 